Welcome to our next tutorial of Quick Surface. When we create our primitives, in many cases it's good to know the quality of our best fit surfaces. And I'll show you what I mean with this. Let's start with the mesh selection. I will just pick this part to define my plane. And then I will just go to the primitives and create a plane. You can see visually on the screen the plane, but you don't know the quality what is the underlying surface. For this purpose we added another checkbox here which you can analyze how close your primitive is to the you know, scan data. And you can see instantly a color map of the displacement of your scan data. You can see that the primitive is rendered as a transparent so you can see the values. You can always change your tolerances for example, here can be 0 0.5, which is 50 microns, and uh, this is what you do. So I will press OK, and I have my plane. To continue this demonstration, let's try to do another shape. I will pick this on the side, which uh, to me looks like a cone, and we'll go to the primitives and select the cone. You see that it roughly created um, the cone, I can again analyze how well it is, but for example here I probably want to just constrain this to be perpendicular to my plane, and still I can see instant deviation analysis of my data, I can probably play with this to be 10 microns, press enter, and you see the real-time deviation of your data. The same thing we will apply for a cylinder and a sphere. And I will just take these, we'll pick my data here, which will define my cylinder. I can increase the sensitivity to get everything that is needed for my cylinder. We'll go and create the cylinder. Again, you have analysis button, and you see, and you can judge the quality of your results. I hope this tool is very useful. Click subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn more in the future. Thank you.